The need for Nigeria to migrate from a resource-dependent economy to a knowledge-driven one comes into focus at the concluding event of the Kaduna Investment and Economic Summit. What is the institutional vision? The plenary session of the summit focuses on the opportunities that will help transform Kaduna State's agricultural sector through the African free trade area. What we produce in Nigeria is actually what is produced around the neighborhoods of Nigeria. The countries around Nigeria also produce the same commodities, cocoa, grains, um, cashews, and so on and so forth. So. The country with the coming of AFCFTA, the economy that will benefit most from agriculture is the one that takes agriculture beyond commodities and into processing. If you want to do anything with maize in Nigeria, you need to satisfy uh, NAPDAC, you need to satisfy SON, you need to satisfy NAQS, that's a quarantine service. If you now need to take the same product to say Egypt, you need to satisfy the equivalent of, of Egypt. And today, they are all different. So what AFCFT is trying to do is to try to harmonize all of these. Other issues raised include the need to make agriculture more attractive for the young force, reliance on human capital to reduce the gap in per capita income and infrastructure development. If you create a lot of um, favorable um, investments in agriculture, like giving uh, fertilizers, giving cheap credits, things like that, I'm sure uh, agriculture is going to be leading in, in whole Nigeria. There is a gap in supply, and it's only when we bring in these youths, we encourage them, we show them that agriculture is actually the game changer. The aim of the 2021 Investment Forum, otherwise called CADINVEST 6.0, is to bring participants up to date with the state's policies and foster intellectual and technological innovations that will build up capacity to grapple with emerging and contemporary economic challenges in the state and the country.